Yes, morning YouTube. We're up early in the morning somewhere in beautiful Texas. Today we'll be talking about how to get yourself right out here on the road after you get in. Stay tuned. What up, what up, what up, what up, YouTube? You're on the station that everybody loves, King of the Road. All right, so now you got into trucking, right? Doesn't matter where you at. You could be no depth, in a lot of depth. Right now, it's time to get focused. Because trust me, you run in this road, the bucks are going to be coming in. So now you got to know how to manage this money that's coming in. You know, might reduce some of your overheads or, you know, save some money. Because the key is, when you run in this road, is putting away I say anywhere from 10 to 30% of your earnings. That's something you pay to yourself. Because this is what's going to help you build. Because remember, you didn't come out here to be a steering wheel holder. You didn't come here to just keep driving a damn truck, holding the wheel, and that's all is your life. Life is more than just driving. Because remember, number one, driving is not nothing. It's an easy thing you do. You get behind the wheel, you go down the road. So you can't really put too much focus in driving. You gotta start putting the focus on what you're earning because what you're earning is what's gonna help you in your endeavors of creating a business, saving some money to probably get an investment going because you gotta have some investments so you could earn some income while you're not working because that's the whole name of this game. You use your money to work for you. Not you working for the money. I know a lot of y'all look at trucking as a job, so it's work. So that's why I'm using this terminology. You use your money to work for you, not the other way around. Okay? So now you, you're big wheel driving right now. You're seeing the checks coming in, you know. You got to start saving. You can't think about going out. You can't think about partying. You can't think about buying this and buying that. You don't want liabilities. Right now is the time to start stacking your money. Stacking your money as tall as you can make it because if you haven't been a saver all your life, just like myself, you know, I've made money, blow money, spend money because that's how I looked at money. Money comes, money goes. That was always my attitude. Money comes, money goes. I know how to get money, so if I need it, I just I know I always knew what to do to get the money. But I never knew how to keep I never knew how to keep the money. Keep the money growing. Growing like a tree Because once you get your money high You could do your investments And you could do what you gotta do In your endeavors Maybe you got a business you're trying to start You could invest in yourself Because I, that's the number one investment You can't be trying to invest in other people's shit Yeah I'm gonna say it. Other people's shit And forget about yours You gotta invest in yourself Before you think about investing in somebody else Stand up on your own two feet Stand upon your own two strength. Invest in yourself. You know what I mean? So again, the key is trying to save anywhere from 10 to 30% of your income. And put it away. Put it away. Put a hey, put as much as you could put away. If you got less overhead, no bills, no, no problem. Just ride, you know? Ride. Don't get caught in the trap of thinking the money is coming it's time to spend it's time to go here it's time to go there no right now trucking is a thing you have to use the capital you make from the cap to from the trucking industry and invest in something passive something that's going to make you money flipping that money that you make because i'm telling you in trucking the money is consistent it's going to keep coming it only stops when you stop so this is the time to start figuring out what you're going to do with your money. What are you going to start investing in? Number one, what are you going to start looking at to see where I could double my money? Because the spending it how you want to spend it is not going to lie. You might be young. So this is the perfect time to put away your money. You don't need it. You don't got no responsibilities. Save your money. 20 to 30, save it. Put it away to buy a great big investment so you don't need to be working when you're 30 and 40. 
You know, here I'm 40 something now, but my plan is in the next five years to 10 years, I have stuff working for me because I'm setting up those things as I'm out here again. You know, cause it's not my first rodeo, you know what I mean? But I was always the mentality Money come, money goes. We spend money. We make money, we spend money. And that's the reality. Because, I mean, once you set up a, a system that it just comes in, you could spend it the way you want to spend it. You know? So, that's what I would say. You got yourself in trucking today. You're trucking down the road. You might be at the training stage where you're making a little bit of money. Still put something away. Don't wait till you're making this much to put something away. Put something away. 5, 10, 20, 30. It doesn't, it doesn't take a lot to add up. You'll be surprised what 30 cents or 10 cents or $1 a day could do for you in life. You'll be surprised. So, King of the Road, coming to you with your another exclusive video. Get your mind right. You are here now. You're trucking. You're living the life. Let's go. Start saving your money for your next big investment which should be in you not in somebody else not in somebody else shims a scheme or what they think might happen and all these market researchers don't waste your time into something you can't control you put your energy and strength in the things you can control which is your life your business so stay tuned pre-trip your truck safety first keep it between the white lines and yo hit that thumbs up before you get out of here